Alright people, welcome back to another custom zombies video today on Black Ops 3, and today we're playing a map called West Trading Company. Now I found this on the Steam Workshop, so I'll leave it down in the description if you guys want to go play it for yourselves. Now, judging by the screenshots of this map, this map actually looked pretty good lighting-wise, so hopefully we have a good map on our hands here. Now, I did not look at the description at all. I'm going into this map 110% blind, so I don't know if there's an Easter egg, if there's, you know, music stuff or anything. So yeah, like I said, I'm going into this 110% blind here, but before we get started, here if you guys could please leave a like and subscribe as we're almost to 3900 subscribers you guys have actually been insane this past month we've been growing here like absolutely insane so seriously thank you to everyone that has subscribed left likes on the videos and uh also i will leave my twitter down in the description as well if you guys want to go follow me over there but uh, i'm not gonna waste any more of your guys' time here let's just uh, get started west trading company so yeah, this is, I think this came out a day or two ago, so yeah, I'm a bit late to this map, but you know, it doesn't really matter, man, it doesn't really matter. I was playing MW3, ooh, look at this loading screen. I was playing MW3 Season 2, but uh, Zombies, unfortunately, does not have any content for Season 2, so we are here on Black Ops 3, dude. Let's be real, there is more effort put into these custom maps than there is effort put into MW3 Zombies, which is pretty sad, man pretty sad some of these custom mappers are actually pretty damn talented so uh Treyarch should actually be hiring them man I know they just got like half their staff laid off or whatever not not half their staff but like most of their staff got laid off but let's uh stop talking about that here let's just get into the map 60 frames we love to see that um oh it gave, gave me an RK5 it doesn't have my attachments on it uh okay we have to press x to activate your flashlight okay I thought I said flashlight for a second I was about to say what kind of map we're we getting into here, man? Okay, 750 debris. Uh, we have a gobble gun machine. That is not going to work. Actually, I do have a perkaholic in there. Uh, select equipment. Yeah, that's not going to work whatsoever. And as you can probably hear, my PC in the background is absolutely going nuts. So sorry about that. But my PC just does not like uh, does not like BO3 because well, it's getting a bit old, and BO3, you know, it requires uh, just a bit of you know horsepower to run games and stuff. Okay, this flashlight is gonna annoy the shit out of me. I can already tell you that. By the way, zombie eye colors look like the BO4 eye colors. They look very bright. BO4 had some very bright eye colors, and they look exactly like that. All right, let's just open up this debris. I'm assuming yeah, open up that side as well. Uh, we got some like ambient sound i don't know what that sound was but it sounded pretty epic dude it sounded pretty epic okay powers this way as long as we don't have buildable power that is all i care about dude buildable power is the bane of custom zombies man hey, look at how bright these eyes are dude that actually looks pretty damn good man pretty damn good detail on the uh, eyes here that's what i have to say so far all right quick revive normal bottle it is the cold war perk machine though and it is not the can which is very weird what Nikolai, what magical potion are you talking about? Also, there's a rubber duck up there. What about the last... Dude, the last map had a rubber duck. Is this going to do something? So that one did something as well. Okay, so there has to be, like, a Quacknarok Easter egg or some shit. Because I know in BO4 you had the uh, Quacknarok uh, elixir. But uh, also, is that a dingo wall by in there? Hold on a minute. Okay, 1500 to go that way. 750 to go this way. What the heck is that? I was just showing some uh, screenshots and stuff. Alright, so pretty cool, pretty cool. I'm super happy more cool BO3 maps are coming out, because like I usually say here, half the BO3 workshop is just total absolute nonsense. And when maps like this come out, it's actually pretty cool, man. It's pretty cool. So uh, I'm super happy to be playing some BO3 here for you guys. Oh, we actually spawned in with the Bloodhound as well. I did not even realize that, dude. It's actually pretty cursed spawning with the Bloodhound on the Primus crew, because obviously they never got the Bloodhound. It was only on the... Shadows of Evil crew that got that, which is very weird, honestly. It was only ever on one map, dude. Okay, 750 debris. Do we want to open you, or do we want to open up the 1500 debris? No, screw it. Let's go this way. Uh, we have the box. The Mob of the Dead box, or the Blood of the Dead box, one of the two. What do we have? What do we have? We have... Ooh, we have the D13 Sector in there. I absolutely love that gun. Amazing gun. Can we inspect? We cannot. Unfortunately. Now, the background noise is kind of loud. I might turn it down here in a second. But, uh, yeah, pretty cool. Pretty cool so far. Alright, this is also the BO3 Galil. This is the DLC version, which is pretty cool to see. I don't know why I didn't add the DLC guns to the weapon kits in BO3. I think that would have been pretty easy since modders could do it. So, really, uh, big missed opportunity on the weapon kits for zombies. But, unfortunately, we cannot have everything here. So, cannot have anything. What the hell does that say? I have no idea, man. I have no idea. Okay, 1500 to go that way. Was there anything else over here besides this debris? We have a computer here. 
Now, like I said, I didn't look at the description. Ooh, this pack a punch. I did not look at the description, so I don't know if there's a huge Easter egg to this map or not. Oh, there's a Tommy gun in there as well. Okay, nice, nice. Uh, ooh, open door. Okay. Wait, please. Oh, wow. Did I open up the freaking Widow's one? I don't even have power on yet, dude. And once again, I found pack a punch before power, like I do on almost every freaking map I play, man. All right, PhD. Should we get another gun? Let's get one more gun just to be safe. Just to be safe here. I don't want to leave and then run out of ammo and shit. Uh, XR2. That is very weird to see because the XR2 usually isn't in uh, Black Ops 3 zombies. It's in the multiplayer in the campaign, but not zombies, unfortunately. Wait a minute. Isn't this on... It might, actually, it might be on Zetsubo. The XR2 might be on Zetsubo. I might be mistaken, dude. Someone correct me in the comments if I am mistaken or not, but I'm pretty sure... I don't know. I might actually be on Zetsubo. I have no idea. I haven't played Zetsubo in a while, man. I don't actually own Zetsubo on PC. The only place I own Zetsubo is on PlayStation and Xbox, so... I haven't really played it in a while here. Alright, they also spawn right there as well. I right, let's just go this way. 1500. Let's, uh, okay, that literally opened up in a circle. That is just so epic. Uh, two, oh, wow, do we have a 205 Broccoli wall by... Oh, wait, another... There's a part here. Uh, oh, it's a shield part. The freaking door from Transit, man. Now, put it down in the comments as well. Do you guys like Transit? Wait, to Pet Seal. What? What? Pet Seal? What the hell? Like a freaking animal seal? Oh, there's a legit seal there, dude. What the fuck? That's probably a, um, a music Easter egg, I would have to guess. That is my only guess here. Or it could be a um, free perk Easter egg like the last map I just played. But, uh, who knows, man? Who knows? Alright, let's wait for the round end to get this double points here. I know I'm spending a bit of time here in, like, the spawn area, but I'm trying to, like, get a grip of, like, you know, the map layout at the spawn area here, so... We will progress here in just a second. Just a second, man. Space capitalism. What the hell is that? Dude, what the hell even is that? Space capitalism. That sounds like some freaking voodoo shit if it sounded anything like it, man. All right, 3,600. We have Jug here. Let's take note of that as well. Get the points off it. Nice, 100 points. Okay, okay. Zombies, I'm going to have to ask you to not give me a nuke, but you did anyway. Uh, okay, additional parts. Okay, debris, I'm assuming that's for the uh, shield. Now, usually the um, transit shield's only two parts, right? Oh, wait, powers are here, dude. What? Okay, well, uh, that was pretty epic. <laughs> I was like, okay, this is going to take forever to find power. But nah, dude, the power's up here. You know what? I'm not even that mad either. I'm not even that mad. I hate when people hide the power in, like, the back of the fucking map. And it's like, bro, I'm not trying to go on some fucking... I'm not trying to go on some freaking Cotton Eye Joe Easter egg hunt, bro. For freaking power. I'm just trying to turn on the power, get the perks and shit. Alright, well, we have the Wonder Fizz there as well. So if we have more than a four perk limit, we can always hit that. We have Cold War's Death Perception. Nikolai, can you stop having an orgasm in my ear, bro? Jesus. Our right, makes the player see zombies through walls. Oh my god, we have the Cold War fucking Plague Hounds. Keep closed. Are they actually be Plague Hounds? That'd be pretty cool if they were. Uh, they are not. It is fake Plague Hounds. I have gotten trolled, ladies and gentlemen. I have gotten trolled by the fake Plague Hound round. They are literally just BO3 dogs with like 1 or 0.1 HP, dude. One hit to the head, man. It's probably actually one hit to the body, if I'm being real. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see, dude. I'm trying to hit him in the freaking... Oh, actually, it's not. It's not. I was mistaken. It is like a three hit to the body. So, big rip, dude. Big rip. Not like out of a pen or anything. I'm just saying like... Oh, he's stuck. Well, glitch. W. Alright, so. Got the max ammo here. I see... Oh, wait. This is the... Okay. I th that... Dude, that looked like a freaking barrier the zombies can jump over. That threw me off. What the heck? Okay, 2,500 to rig outside. I hear Widow's Wine over here, man. I hear Widow's Wine. It's not very loud, though. I don't have the game volume turned up that loud because last recording, it was a bit too loud and my voice was a bit too low, so hopefully it's fixed this recording. I did a test recording just, you know, for my voice beforehand, so it sounded good, so hopefully it's all good. Because if it's not, I'm going to be very upset. Very upset. All right, zombies, please, dude. Give me your health care, man. Give me your health care, dude. I need those damn COVID taxes. All right, it's a kill. 3,100. Max ammo. Oh my god, dude, leave me alone, man. Leave me alone. All right. Death machine. I don't know why they changed the death machine to uh, full power, dude, in Cold War or whatever. 
sounded pretty not epic, man. Uh, we have a we dude. That looks like a fucking like vodka bottle or some shit. How the hell is that a weevil, dude? I am not gonna. It's five grand too. What the dude? That's definitely COVID tax. That's insane. All right, we have dead shit. See, is it? Here's the thing. Is this gonna be the Cold War version where it's like 1.5 times headshot or whatever, or is it just gonna be fake like the uh, plague hound round? By the way, that's not a shot at the map or anything. That's just, you know, me noticing shit. That is not a shot at the map. This map actually looks pretty damn good, dude. It has the default, um, giant skybox. Is this? I don't think it's the giant. It might be, uh, not. Nah, it's not Nocturne Tone because the moon's, like, way bigger on Nocturne Tone. All right, gobble gum machine, stamina up. We have another stamina bottle. Or another perk bottle, I should say. Uh, we have an electric thing over here. Uh, we have a gate over here. Break the lock. Oh, okay. End game. 50 grand. Okay. Uh, is that the whole map? Is that actually the whole map? I mean, hey, I'm not complaining. Shorter editing time for me, but this map from the screenshots looked pretty damn big to me. That's also what she said, but still, man. Oh my god, let me alone, let me alone. Oh, nope, nope. I am not dying on round nine, my dude. Oh, also, the round counter actually looks a bit different as well. Just a tad bit different. Oh, I'm dead. No, I'm not. Get cucked, zombies. 50 grand shouldn't take that long here. Nuke. Let's, uh... Uh, you know what? No. Uh, actually, we're gonna have to get it. I was gonna say, let's not get double tap two so we can build more points, but Black Ops 3 is, like, insane with, like, the hitting, so... Might as well grab that. Honestly, no, wait. How the hell do we get... How the hell do we get pack a punch open, I'm just realizing? Because it's right there. Oh, honestly, I might have to find more of those things to hold square on, because I found one already. Can't be that much, because I don't think this map's that big by the looks of things, so... We'll find it here, we'll find it. We will find it. Alright, it's the kill. Uh, okay, here's the other shield part. Should be able to build it now. The transit shield isn't that bad, but it's like the worst out of them all, because, well... Doesn't really have anything to offer besides, you know, protecting you. Doesn't have, like, a blast, like, Garage Grover or some shit. Alright, can we build this? Okay, yeah, craft zombie shield. I kind of want to save a zombie, but, like, there's an insta-kill active right now, and we really can't. Okay, let's grab Speed Cola. Please be more than a four perk limit. That would be so epic, dude. That would actually be so epic. You know, what's not epic, though, is that we don't have a zombie counter. That is not epic. Alright, uh, get a grenade. Oh, it's the World at War grenades. That's, that's actually very different. <laughs> world at War grenades and fucking BO3, alright. I am not complaining whatsoever. Alright, we have a crawler, nice, nice. Alright, let's go build a shield, and let's figure out how the hell to get Pack-a-Punch open. Alright, take, give me you, ZM Zod Rocket Hint, so it is just a reskin of the Derizon Drag. Okay, here's, the, I bet you it just opens up that. I bet you it just opens up that. So yeah, that's just a reskin of the Derizon Drac shield. Because it says... Or not the uh, Derizon Drac shield, the um, Shadows of Evil shield. Because it says Z-O-D. Which means zombies on disc, so... Okay, I'm 19-27. Pack-a-punch. Definitely gonna pack-a-punch. We wanna see what kind of camo we got here. See if there's a custom camo or not. Alright, three grand. Doing good so far here. Honestly, dude, if this is the whole map, I... Honestly, it's pretty damn good. I honestly give it a 7 out of 10. It's not that big as I thought it would be. That's what she said again. But, uh, yeah, it's pretty decent, I guess. I mean, you could, I bet you could load some mods up on the. Oh, there's another duck. There's another duck, dude. Okay, got another duck. I don't know if we need to find three ducks, four ducks, five ducks, six ducks, or all ducks. I have no idea, dude. Maybe it's like a Dr. Monty Easter egg. Maybe he just says, like, I am that duck or some shit. I have no idea, dude. I have no idea. Also, we're almost out of ammo. And honestly, I might just buy the KN44 up here because I saw it up here, right? Yeah, just give me the KN, dude. I like how it has all the uh, attachments on it as well. These aren't even mine either. These are uh, part of the map, which is pretty damn cool. It's not that hard to put them on either. It's literally just in a weaponless file. You just change the attachments. It's pretty cool, though. Okay, I keep forgetting. I keep turning off my flashlight. That is the one bad thing about playing on controller. Is I keep, like, double-tapping X or square like that, and it turns off the flashlight. Which I, I really wish the flashlight was bound to the... Um, the D-pad, it would make it so much easier. But, uh, I don't know if they could do that, man. I don't know. Are there any more ducks? Are there any more ducks, dude? Trying, I really... Oh, yeah, there's one, there's one. Duck. Alright, we got them, I think. Oh, is that another one? Bruh. How many ducks are there? Is there one on top of there? 
No, I don't think so. Well, we hit four ducks so far, so... I don't know what that does. All I know is that they're ducks. And yeah, that's all I can answer. Because, well... Like I said, I did not look at the description for this map, so I have no fucking clue. Okay, we have this thing here. Anything in this back corner. Uh, Gobblegum. Actually, let's try getting Perkaholic, dude. Let's try getting Perkaholic, man. Uh, select equipment. Yeah, this isn't gonna give me shit, dude. Yeah, nothing. Dude, give me a Perkaholic. This would be epic. Give me a... Oh, there it is. There it is. We got it, dude. Get yeeted. Oh, oh, that actually, that's a pretty decent selection of perks. Oh, I like how you can see them all through the walls, though. That's pretty nice. That is pretty nice, dude. Anything on the HUD? Nah. Don't have, like, a shield HUD or anything. Well, if that is all to the map here... Now, I did find four ducks. I don't know if there's going to be a fifth duck or sixth duck, like I said, but... Was there any in spawn? It didn't look good enough in spawn, dude. Honestly, it's probably just a side easter egg. It's probably not anything too important, so I probably won't end up looking for it, but... Whatever, man, whatever. Now, I probably will cut a little bit of the gameplay out, building up to 50k, just because it is going to take just a bit here. So if there are cuts, then that is why. That is why, man. Alright, death machine. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, my PC is going nuts as well in the background. Okay, what the heck did the seal do, man? What the hell did the seal do? I have no idea what the hell the seal did because we pet it and that's about it. <laughs> I mean, it's a pretty cool side easter egg, but I don't know what it has to do with anything. If anything at all. Uh, there's a phone. There's Nero poster. There's another debris. I'm just trying to, like, look out for anything. Oh, there's another duck. I see it. I see it. It's right there. Can you guys see it? Oh my god, give me this. The duck is right there, man. Shoot it. Alright, so I shot five of them. I don't know what the hell that's gonna do. I hear a bunch of freaking duck noises. Oh my god, they have the duck floats on from BO4. They have the duck floats on from BO4, dude. Why the hell is my FPS going down like 52? What the hell's going on here, man? Is it because they spawn in all the freaking duck floats? Probably. Probably. Dude, let me turn on the graphics just for a sec. Holy shit. Everything's on extra and shit, so turn that down to medium. I have no idea why my FPS just decided to dip to freaking 40, man. That is the most random shit ever. Whatever, whatever. My PC is going nuts in the background. Okay, we're back at 60 somehow. Alright, whatever. <laughs> whatever, my dude. Alright, we're at 17 grand. That's a pretty cool side easter egg, the freaking Kraknarok thing. Now, there was a duck easter egg in the last map. I didn't find all the ducks. I'm assuming this is what it was going to do. So, I called the crack. Uh, I called the uh, Kraknarok thing, so... All right, let's get more ammo here. I am probably just going to end up saving up for the viable now, so I will honestly be back when I have closer to uh, 50 grand here. I'll be back in just a second. Actually, I almost totally forgot. Before I start actually like fully saving up, I actually want to see what the uh, Pack-a-Plunge camo is, if it's anything too insane here. Let's see, let's see. It is just the Revelations camo here, so it's not anything too insane. So yeah, I'll be back when I have enough for the uh, ending here. Alright people, I am back here. I have 40 grand. Might as well just start the recording again here when I am closer to the ending. But yeah, I only need 9 more grand, so it shouldn't take me that much longer to get there. But yeah, I'd say honestly a solid 7 out of 10 map. I wish I had more to the area, honestly. I don't know if he's still working on this map. Oh my god, Nikolai, please, man. I'm trying to explain to everyone what's going on. You're over here yapping about some bullshit, my dude. I don't know if he's going to update it at all, but uh, that's the one suggestion I would have, is just add more areas, because I originally thought this map was going to be bigger from the screenshots, but apparently it is not. Also, this fucking XR2 sucks, man. It's like one bursting to the head, but not really. If you, like, shoot him in the body, it kind of sucks. But whatever, I guess, whatever. Oh my god, I keep turning the damn flashlight off, too. That's another thing I don't like. I don't really like the flashlight in maps because it's, like, so broken sometimes in controller. Not broken, but it's just, like, a bad mechanic for, like, the square button. Alright, 47,000. Uh, death machine. Actually, oh my god, I didn't want to grab that. God damn it, dude. Freaking Hiroshima, my guy. Oh my god, there we go saying my guy again, dude. I don't know why, I don't know when I started saying that, but it's kind of annoying me, dude. It's kind of annoying me. Can I get points off this? Is it even possible? There's a fucking red solo cup, dude. 
Oh, dude, Rip Toby Keith, though. Rip Toby Keith, the guy who's saying Red Solo Cup. Oh my god, of course, a freaking dog round as well. We might be able to get the ending if I get enough points. But most likely, knowing my luck, I will not get enough points. Oh, wait, can I just knife with the Widows? No, I got 10 points for that. That was not epic. Alright, 49,000. Okay, dogs. Saying, okay, that's also another thing. Like, dogs get glitched up there if you don't open up that debris. But, uh, yeah, let's go camp outside for the rest of here, because we only need 400 more points or so, so. Yeah, man, solid 7 out of 10 map, but, uh, yeah, pretty cool, pretty cool, man. I, d I didn't think I was going to find all the, uh, ducks, because I thought there would be, like, 20 or some shit, but there was only, like, 5, so. Pretty cool, man. What the hell does that say? Toy soldiers report for duty. Body count. What the hell does that say? I have no idea, man, I have no idea. Okay, let's get it, man, let's get it. Game over. You survived 21 rounds. Oh, we have the BO2 animation. What the heck? All right, that's going to be West Trading Company. I will leave it down in the description if you guys want to play it for yourselves. But if you guys are new here, like I said, leave a like, subscribe, and recommend me any other maps I haven't played. I will see you guys on the next one here.